Jean-Pierre Jeunot is here. He is a French filmmaker whose love of cartoons and animation heavily influence his visual style. Also joining us is actress Audrey Tautou. Their 2001 film, Emily, earned five Academy Award nominations and won four Caesar Awards. It is also the highest grossing French language film in history. Their new collaboration is called A Very Long Engagement. Here is a look at the film. I am pleased to have them both at this table for the first time. Welcome. Thank you, Welcome. Thank you for inviting yeah. us. Oh, my pleasure. Uh, we, this is a return of you two working together. Exactly. Why did you decide you wanted to work together again? And why this story for you? I didn't choose her. She chose me. She did. Fact, yeah. yeah. It was her choice. Yeah. Yes. So I should ask her. Yes. You. Why, did you choose him? Yes, I chose him because I wanted him to make another movie, yeah. you know. No, I... So, what was it about him that you liked from Emily? Oh, it's our relationship in the work. Because we have a very, very good relationship, very easy when we are working together. And uh, the shooting on Emily was so good, so interesting, so wonderful. So, it was a real pleasure, so, you know. For, and, uh, I for those, to it again. I mentioned how successful Emily was. Why do you think it was so successful? Good story, so, good yeah. acting, good direction. Yeah, but, but this movie has a special <clears throat> charm, but it's very difficult to analyze. I, I have no idea why uh, people, you know, love this movie so more than, much. More than other good movies. Maybe because it speaks about something good we have inside. Everybody has something good. Everybody, yeah. And but it's very difficult to, to speak about that with a film without to be too much sugary or with violence like mm. Hollywood movie, you know. And we tried, and I think that's the reason of the success because it's the film speaks about generosity. Do you think there is a a hunger for that to, for films that reflect what is good within us? Absolutely, and it was maybe it was the right timing for this kind of movie. Everybody needed, and especially in states, uh, the film released just after the September 11, yes. and it was a, a good timing to watch a positive film. And uh, you know, it's it's not easy to to write a story positive. It's so easier to to write a, a dark story. I did. I know by heart because I made Delicatessen. It yeah. was uh, comedy. Delicatessen. Delicatessen. Yes, mm -hmm. and the city of Lord Children, and it was dark comedy. But it's easier. For a positive story, you have to, to think a lot. This is a film about World War yes, One. Yeah. Why did you choose that subject? And really, I don't know. I am. I have a big fa fascination. Fascination. With one. About, about the first World War. Yeah. Not the second. The second war. The first World War. Not ask me why. I I do all the time the same joke. I say I I think I died in you know, another life during the war. It's yeah. maybe it's not just a joke. I don't you believe think? I don't believe about reclamation, but who knows? Yeah. When I came for the first time inside the, the set on the trench, I had the feeling I knew that. Mm -hmm. I climbed up on the ladder, I saw the no man's land and I think, Oh my god mm -hmm. I put an helmet on my head and I oh mm -hmm. I had a bad feeling. Strange. I met um, an American guy in San Francisco who told me exactly the same thing, exactly the same feeling. I died too in the, the first war. Oh, really? Yeah, he's, he's alive today, but he feels like he died in the first war. Yeah, he's exactly. come back. And we can do a club. <laughs> <laughs> How is it different to make a French a film in France, say, the, and then to make a film outside of France? Um, it's easier for me to speak French than sure. to speak English, as you can hear. Yes. <laughs> so um, I, I, you know, I feel freer uh, when I, I acting in French. Uh, but in another way, I like a challenging part. So I, I, I really enjoy to work in English. The, um, I think that the feelings, the attention, how to act the characters, there's no difference because I think people are the same depending on uh, their nationality or. Um, I mean, the, the language doesn't, you know, change the situation in a movie or 
you know, the characters. Tell me about your character in this film. Mattel, she's a, for me, she's a very determined person. She's very strong and very proud. But she has a failure because she lost um, her lover. You know, and she wants to, she's ready, she's like a soldier for me, she, she, she's fighting to, to try to find an answer, you know. As she, to why she lost him? An answer about what happened, you know, about uh, her lover, you know, because uh, she had been told that her lover died in the war. But? But she's certain that's not true. And as the situation, the condition around this uh, death are suspicious, she's going to make an inquiry, you know, to know the truth. Because maybe he's still alive, and that's what she thinks. So she has hope. Yes. Yeah, she has a drive. She has a the drive. The weak power, she's very strong. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's a very nice character, even in the book. If I looked at most of your work, your body of work, you okay, would I see certain themes mm -hmm. yes themes yeah common themes yeah what would they be for example which themes? Uh, would they faith uh, yeah. stubbornness yeah. Uh, will yeah. uh, strong women <clears throat> maybe that's my story because you know when I was 17 <laughs> I was a worker I worked in a phone company my way wasn't the, um, for the cinema you know and to go to the phone company until a very long engagement produced by Warner Bros. You have to be very strong. Yeah, maybe yes, that's yes, 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 yes. To work from the phone company to making a film yes, yeah. produced by Warner Brothers, yes. you have to have, yeah, you have determination. To, yes, exactly. Discipline. Yeah, especially in France. <laughs> <laughs> what is the state of the French film industry today? Um, it's not very good. It's not uh, very powerful. And uh, we lost uh, a good source, Canal Plus. Yes. And, and it was a good. It's a good opportunity to work with a big studio like Warner because it's um, this film is a French production, but the film will be distributed by Warner everywhere in the world, and it's a kind of historical event because it, that's the first time since maybe the La Cage aux Folles. Yes. Yeah. And um, we have a problem in France because the French producer tries to get rid of Warner out of France, you know. I know. I know. Yeah, because they are jealous. And, but it's a pity for French te technicians, actors, and in French industry because everybody is very proud about this film. It's a big, ambitious French film. D your film? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Do you work all the time? In other words, do you have one role after the other? Are you mm. lined up no, with scripts? I, no, I need to take some break to um, regenerate myself. You know, I like to keep the same enthusiasm than when I started. So I, I travel. I discover mm. this world. Where have you been traveling to? Um, I went to Indonesia, to Vietnam, to Iceland, to. Mexico to Europe mm, to where to Cameroon to mm. North Africa. Um, wow! Hey, didn't know. Well, uh, no. Let's look at a clip from this film. Here it is. <laughs> Now, Warner Brothers decided to do this because of the success of Emily? I think so. It helps a lot. So you got you, and you got you, and so yeah, therefore let's they try it the, again. They had the rights, and they wrote a script, and they were very happy to, to see a French director. When, uh, when I said I would like to, to make this film, they were, okay, okay. And I remember I said, uh, but I want to make this film in French, because that's our history. It doesn't make sense to make this film in English. Mm. And they said, okay, no problem. And I said, but I want to have the final cut. 
because mm -hmm. we are used to it in France. And they said, okay, no problem. No problem. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to, to shoot in, in France with French technician, and it was the case. And I have to say something is very important for me. They g gave me the complete freedom, no pressure, only compliments all the time. So if the film is good, it's your credit. If Maybe. the film is not so good, it's your fault. Mm, yeah, but you know, only compliments. How much did it cost? A in, lot in, for us, for in euros. France. It, in euro, it was forty-five five million, million, million euro. euro. Yeah. I suppose in States the film will be more expensive, yeah. much more expensive. Is that mainly because the actresses are so expensive? No, the actress is very cheap. <laughs> yeah, I'm cheaper than an American actress. That's the reason I hire the hell. Yeah. Uh, what, will you take time off now that you completed, when did you complete this, this film? Um, we completed it uh, um, at the end of January, I think, beginning of February. So you've had a while off since you finished the film? Not really, because I, I worked uh, on um, another movie. I shot another movie from Cedric Clapiche, the following of uh, The Spanish Apartment. The what? The Spanish Apartment. Oh, The Spanish the, Apartment, yeah. yeah. Uh, so, but I had some time off. Do you act on stage? No, not yet. Do you want to? Yeah, I wish. You do? Yes. Do you have a role that you like? Or just wait mm, for something interesting? Yeah, I like surprises. Yeah. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Pleasure to have you. Thank you. Much success. Thank you.